Many expected last night's vice presidential debate, debate to be subdued, but as Tim Kaine and Mike Pence went head to head, it proved to be more spirited than anticipated. Two News reporter Kelly King has the face off in your Decision 2016 coverage. It didn't take long for the two VP nominees to clash. During the 90 minutes, they spoke over one another to make their cases heard. Hillary Clinton said something on the campaign trail, and the very next day she said, you know what, I shouldn't have said that. Look for Donald Trump apologizing to John McCain for saying he wasn't a hero. Oh, cool. Did Donald Trump apologize for calling women slobs, pigs, dogs, disgusting? She did apologized for saying... Governor, it is his two did, minutes, please. Did, did, did Donald Trump apologize for taking after somebody in a Twitter war and making fun of her weight? I was listening to the avalanche of insults coming out of Senator Kane a minute ago. The, the, these these were said, Donald... He says... He, hold it's, hold it's, on a second, It's my Governor. time, Senator. Uh, it is, in, it in is, fact, right. the governor's time. He says, this is your two minutes. Thanks, I forget. If Donald Trump had said all the things that you said he said in the way you said he said them, he still wouldn't have a fraction of the insults that Hillary Clinton leveled when she said that half of our supporters were a basket of deplorables. Both candidates attacked each other's downfalls. Pence tried to paint the Democratic ticket as career politicians. Kane challenged Trump's controversial statements. Among the other issues brought up, Russia, immigration, nuclear weapons, and taxes. Governor Pence had to give Donald Trump his tax returns to show he was qualified to be vice president. Donald Trump must give the American public his tax returns to show that he's qualified to be president, and he's yeah. breaking his promise. His tax returns that showed he went through a very difficult time, but he used the tax code just the way it's supposed to be used, and he did it brilliantly. As for who won, according to a CNN ORC poll, 48% said Pence, 42% said Kane. The spotlight returns to the top of the ticket when Hillary Clinton and Donald Trump take the stage Sunday in St. Louis for their second debate. Kelly King, 2 News Today, working for you.